see that, Sammy. I mean, we have a rise in nursing homes. And well, I was just reading an article, uh, and it almost just made your heart so heavy because it said that one out of three elderly people are feeling extreme loneliness and depression. One out of three. And then it said that number is increasing. And, and they were quoting from some of these elders that they, if it wasn't for going to doctors and nurses, they wouldn't even see a human being for days. So how is that healthy for any of us? So the way that God had set up the creation, there are laws that govern it. If we obey those laws, we'll be happy. And part of the law is if people take care of you, and then when they get older and they can't take care of themselves, you should help take care of them. That's just part of the cycle of compassion and love. Now, the way people have to work and the way people are so disunified, they can't figure out how to do it. But if we make it a priority and if we simplify our lives and if we have more working together, like my mother lived with me for four years and she had uh, in a mental health issue and my sisters and brothers, we all tried to band together and, and take care of her, but she lived with us, so the heavy responsibility was on us. And it got really heavy, you know. But I was grateful, Samuel, that the Lord had allowed us, and my husband, bless his heart, to take care of my mother until she left her body. I was grateful for that. And so we have to figure those things out. What, what are the priorities as human beings? You know, we. Uh, we're all going to get old anyway, too, and shoving these elders aside, they have wisdom. Maybe physically they're not stronger, but they have things that they can share to the to other generations.